G'day, it's George Truman, and welcome to What the Wednesday. Recently I caught up with Ruth and Lyle Ranger at Gravesend, along with our project officer, Keith Walker. I was keen to follow up on the hydro mulch project we had been involved with in recent years and see how it has improved the ground cover across the farm. Thanks, George. And thanks, Ruth and Lyle, for uh, making the time to have a bit of a chat today about uh, projects on Rosevale. So what we've done over the last few years is worked with Ruth and Lyle on a number of different projects across the property here and trying to blend our natural assets in with our production assets and look at a holistic way of managing and developing the enterprise. And to their credit, Ruth and Lyle have done some amazing work on Rosevale, some um, areas of revegetation. Uh, they've fenced out some brigalow areas and um, done some cover cropping trial work. And also where we're standing is part of a 10 hectare trial for hydromulching. So Ruth, how do you think that the natural resource management projects have fitted into the development and the operation of Rosevale? I think the hydromulch has gone really well. It's got a good coverage of grass and that on it now. It'll be interesting to see, you know, when we get trees and that come up. Uh, but no, overall it's 100% better than, with the ground cover than what it was before. Right across northwest New South Wales and entire state, we've had the worst drought on record. When we did this, um, this hydromulching project, when we first started it, we started to head into the drought. That's correct. And then now what we see with a little bit of, of rain and the, um, the reforming of the banks and um, some of the erosion areas for the hydromulching project, we're seeing with that little bit of moisture coming through as the drought has been subsiding somewhat, um, we've got a range of ground covers that are coming up. That's great, Keith showcasing the work you've been doing with Ruth and Lyle Ranger. So that's it for our What the Wednesday. We look forward to seeing you next week.